The initial work made on the piece to hard face and the spraying of powder are essential steps in the procedure. They generate a good welding. The temperature when applying the product has to be considered too. The quality of the deposit is dependent on the clearing of the surface to hard face. Previous hard facing deposits must be completely removed except for initial technodur or technosphere deposits. Use a jig to position the piece during welding. The most convenient tool is a hard grinder to remove all rust and dirt. Sharp edge must be beveled. At this stage, you can use our powder spray torch Techno 2000. Connect the powder injector to the red handle. Choose the right size of tip accordingly to the size of the piece. Tighten the powder hopper and fill it up. Light the torch using the following pressure. 55 psi or 4 bars for oxygen, 11 psi or 0.8 bar for acetylene. Depress the powder trigger after lighting the torch only. After clearing, orient the piece on the jig to give the maximum access to the surfaces to be powdered. Before spraying, the piece must be preheated at 300 degrees Fahrenheit through color. Start spraying and allow a gap of 5 inches between the flame and the piece. When the piece is sprayed powdered, the deposit binds perfectly to the base metal. The thin layer of powder is there to prevent oxidation while applying Technodur or Technosphere. The powder doesn't go through. Check the hopper and add more powder if necessary. The inner plastic tube might be plugged. To unplug it, turn the gas off and remove the hopper. Plugging the tip with one finger, open the oxygen line and depress the powder spray handle. This should unplug the plastic tube. Don't try to cover the piece in one move. It is better to organize the job step by step drawing some guideline with a choke marker. The application must be done with the piece placed horizontally. Before applying the wire, the temperature of the piece must be at least 400 degrees Fahrenheit minimum. Both positions, wire to torch and torch to the piece, are very important. Keep in mind your welding job will be done working on three planes height, width and length. Therefore, a good coordination of your both hands is needed. The deposit must be absolutely done on the horizontal side of a piece. Start to apply the wire onto the cutting edges of the tooth to avoid oxidation. Do not drum the wire on the piece. You must try to get a flow as regular as possible, focusing the flame onto the transfer zone. As we have seen it before, the application should be done horizontally as far as possible. In some cases, a slight slope less than 60 degrees may be accepted.
As you have noticed earlier, the first deposit done on the tooth started from the top of it. The other deposits will be done in the same way, that means from the top of this tooth. Then, you'll fill in between them. This process will always be the same, whatever the number of faces to be hard-faced. Remember to avoid overheating the piece, especially the edges of the thin parts to prevent oxidation. When the tooth is entirely hard-faced, let it cool down a little bit and apply a last string on the cutting edge. <laughs> 